Okay guys, so let's get started. The first step is to cover our eyebrows. Take a washable purple glue stick and thoroughly glue your eyebrows down. First go against the hair and then glue them upward against your face. When it's dry, powder it with a white powder. If they aren't fully glued down, repeat these steps. Next, take an orangey foundation or concealer and pat it down. Always pat down so you don't disturb the glue. And apply more powder. Next, take a white foundation and you're literally going to cake this on. We are talking like three layers, people. You want to get a perfect coverage all over. Be sure to blend well between each layer as well. Then set it with powder. So for the eyebrows, outline right where the top of your real eyebrow used to be. Take a black or dark gray eyeshadow and lightly pencil them in. We are using eyeshadow because it looks much more natural than using gel liner, so that is what I advise using. Now for the eyes, apply white eyeliner to your lid and blend it. Next, take a gray and an angled brush and outline your eyelid right into the crease. Then take the same eyeshadow and fill upward all the way to your real eyebrow. Don't blend out the eyeshadow too much at the edges, keep it more like a circle and use a card to get a nice crease on the side. Then take black eyeshadow and darken the outer corner and the crease line. Lastly, take a bright frosty silver and apply it lightly on the eyelid. Now for the eyeliner, just do a basic thin line on the top and on the bottom and be sure to get your water lines as well. Then add winged wispy lashes and mascara to the top and bottom. For the lips, just fill them in with a true red and make sure your cupid's bow is exaggerating. If you want to look more like the actress, I recommend underdrawing your lips to be thin if you have thick lips. Now to look more like the actress, take a light gray and apply it right above where you normally would contour. This will make your face appear much longer. Then apply white foundation under your eyes and down the sides of your mouth since that is the brightest part of her face. Set that with powder. And for her nose, contour a line on each side straight down your nose and blend it downward on each side. Lastly, make sure your neck and chest are the same color. So this is me before, and this is me after. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't seen me transform into Wednesday Adams, click this box right here on the screen or click the link in the description box and I'll see you next time.